our country is kind of divided right now, well, politically. As far as politics, there's a bit of corruption. To me, voting means, it doesn't mean as much as it should. The inequality that is getting more and more extreme. Things are not equitable. And the basic things that you need to live in society are at risk. Are you hungry? I am. What happened in Katrina was like not okay. The amount of neighborhoods, the amount of groups of people, specifically in low economic status areas that were not supported was not okay. Because there's professional organizations that do work and, and that's all that people know, they, then they start to think, okay, well, I don't really need to actually do anything. It kind of creates a barrier between ordinary people doing what's right. We need to find some more of a sense of community, you know. Come together with people, put aside your petty differences. There has to be a sense of stewardship that you have sort of an obligation or a duty. I made myself a promise. I chose a way of life and I decided to keep that promise. Whether or not I had children, whether or not I had to do food shopping, no, no matter what else, that that was a focus. Showing up for hearings, speaking out when we thought it was important, throwing fundraisers that get donated to other parts of the community, supporting politicians, doing voter registration drives. If your town is corrupt or anything you work in is corrupt, use that corrupt nature to find your way in. So you go there and you slowly make a change. You take that energy and you work with people who are willing to work just as hard as you. And at least plant the seed. You never know who you may inspire to pick up right where you left off. I think the most kind of amazing and impressive thing that's gone on is the array of diversity. Everybody's involved. Like we're talking about like working side and side with like cops, firefighters, government officials, community leaders, organizational leaders, church leaders, like everybody's involved. It's the right thing to do. Being able to give back to the community is what keeps me going and listening to them and tell their stories and being able to feel what they feel. So much negativity, especially in inner city going around, like we can all point our finger at it. It's always something that uh, we could say that is not right. But if you're not doing anything to change it, then you're just complaining. A lot of people have asked us, well, who are you with? Well, we're not with anybody, we're with ourselves. I tell people, we're with, we're with you. If you want to see some change, then you start off and then eventually people will follow. You are the scent of hope. You are like that, that sweet smelling aroma. You're restoring hope, the belief that there's going to be a new normal again.